That was the scene inside the legislature yesterday afternoon as QP members and supporters shouted down the government when Bill 28 was passed. As you can see, security was called in. They were removed from the public gallery at Queen's Park. But the Ford government's use of the notwithstanding clause to help protect the legislation uh, from any constitutional challenges is controversial. My understanding is that these fines are, are meant to be more of a discouragement. They're trying to prevent illegal strikes from happening. Each day, of course, the fines increase. And so I wouldn't be surprised if there's some sort of a deal. You know, the government doesn't impose the fines in exchange for hopefully the workers going back to work sooner. But you're right, it's a lot of workers to issue fines against and certainly would take a long time to process and, and you know, see any sort of actual recovery.